took too much advice. Thank you for uh, turning yourself up over to help out. Go on. We so tired. Well, we're going to do it. We're going to do Ni tiko na valislez. Sta sale Sorvaki. The uh, coach of the uh, Fijian uh, road team. Sta Senrusi Sorvakula. Uh, Turanga na Jimenez. Pedeli. Tender Langi. Our um, members of the team. In other words, we be the officials, Rototala, Reverend Julian Metindau, members of the media, ladies and gentlemen, Sambul of Nakhon, very good morning to you all. Now, at the outset, I wish to acknowledge and thank the good Reverend for sharing with us a few words of divine wisdom and direction and a prayer to inspire us all and strengthen further our belief in Almighty God as we gather here to farewell you, the members of the group team, in the traditionally the okay protocol with the presentation of the Tatao Batura. Navale. Pronto Tatao. Navale of Nanomuni Ritumberum Tanqua. Navale of Namas. Gentlemen, as your president, head of state, it is such a pleasure, it's always a pleasure, to welcome you all to the newly renovated State House Conservatory. Because last year we conducted a similar ceremony up at the Boron House before you left. Now, as usual, I deem it an honor to receive all of you on behalf of government and the people of Fiji. On rural rugby team, you who will be departing our shores very shortly to defend the Australian National Rugby Championship title, which you gallantly won at the end of the competition last year. Now, I welcome your visit to present the Ita Tau in the same manner and spirit that I've always done in welcoming our national teams that had come before you. In that regard, I congratulate all of you for your selection into the Fijian Road team. Well done for making the cut. Now, many are called, but only a few are chosen. Your performances at the 2018 Australian National Rugby Championship were exceptional. And your overall achievement in winning the championship was another great milestone and a feather in our cap as a sporting and rugby loving nation. Again, you have stamped the name of our beloved nation in the annals of world rugby as champions with your show of strength, courage, perseverance, commit, perseverance commitment, teamwork, but more importantly, by retaining and promoting our winning Fijian Bula spirit a proud and enviable passion to excel and win. Now, I personally believe that when you combine teamwork, hard work, perseverance with divine guidance, and the empowerment of Almighty God as alluded to by the good Reverend, nothing is impossible. I have every confidence that you will again succeed with your team objective to perform exceptionally well in defending your championship title. And I think I speak on behalf of the nation. I'm also pleased to know that this team comprises of local players who have shown the selectors and the officials that you deserve to be selected in the Fiji Rugby Union Road Team and hopefully make it into our National Flying Fijians team in future. Now I'd like to remind you to know and understand that being selected to represent our beloved nation in any international sporting competition at any level has always been very challenging indeed because you will be expected to perform to the best of your abilities as expected of you by your coaches, your colleagues, your team members, your families and friends, and especially from a rugby mad and loving Fijian community here at home and right throughout other parts of the world, members of our wider global diaspora. At this juncture, I would like to acknowledge the hard work that your coach is and the officials are put towards your preparation and in ensuring that you maintain and retain 
competitive edge and relevance at all times enable you to succeed in your mammoth task ahead. And you all know too well how important rugby is to our beloved nation. And this is one sport that can bring all our people together. Rugby is no longer just a game. It is also a means for a better life for many of you and your families. It is increasingly an important contributor to our country's economic growth as well. Now, you are going as a team, not as, indivi not as individuals. You also go as sports ambassadors for our beloved nation. You carry the reputation of our nation on your shoulders, a lot of responsibility. Please do this with dignity and honor. Please allow me to give you some fatherly advice. To the players, I would like to remind you to remain focused, listen to your coaches and officials, play as a team, and look after one another. Be good ambassadors on and off the field and always display good sportsmanship by accepting victory with humility and defeat graciously. Now, in conclusion, I would like to remind you <clears throat> of my other responsibility as your, our beloved nation's chief advocate and champion in our national endeavors to combat what you already know, the present real and clear threat of the prevalence of non-communicable diseases and related ailments. Much has been said about it, but I'd just like to remind you about the importance of this issue. Now, please maintain your fitness and continue to manage a healthy lifestyle by eating well and exercising daily as our nation spends too much money, in fact, millions of dollars annually on the need to treat all these NCD-related ailments. Now, these are much-needed funds that could be diverted to help you develop your rugby careers. I therefore accept you the town on behalf of Governor of Fijians with sincere appreciation and gratitude and wish you well and every success as you depart our shores and venture forth to do battle on the rugby field in the days ahead. Be assured that our prayers and good wishes go with you. Almighty God bless you and our beloved nation. Navalek.